hello friends welcome to my channel devs institute today i am going to talk about gray code and its conversions gray codes are the codes where two subsequent numbers differ only by single digit they are also called as reflected binary code first we will see how how to write gray codes and then we will see its conversion into binary code and conversion of binary code into gray code single bit gray code is written as 0 and 1 two bit gray code now we are already aware of the binary number systems so two bit when we said two, when we say two bit then there are four possible combinations so two bit gray code consists of four different numbers to form this two bit gray code first we copy this single bit gray code in the lsb position of first two numbers of two bit gray code like this so this 0 and 1 is a single bit gray code the 0 and 1 is copied here then it is considered that there is mirror placed over here that's why it is called as a reflected code so these bits on the lsb of the lsb are reflected below so this one is reflected here and this zero will be reflected here so by this our lsb becomes 0 1 1 0 i repeat first this single bit gray code is copied here at the lsb position 0 1 then it is considered that mirror is placed and the above code is reflected as it is at the below cells so this one is reflected here and zero will be reflected here on the msb side first half of the cells are filled with zero and rest half of the cells are filled with one so our final two bit gray code becomes 00011110 i repeat first the single bit gray code is copied here then this one is reflected below this zero is reflected this zero one is reflected so it becomes 10 then first half of the row are filled with zero next half of the row are filled with one now this two bit gray code is used to form the three bit gray code now three bit gray code so when we are talking about three bit there will be definitely eight possible combinations of the code so there will be eight rows our two bit gray code is 00011110 so like we did for two bit gray code we copied single bit gray code at the lsb position similarly we'll copy this two bit gray code at the first four rows of the three bit gray code so this is my two bit gray code 00011110 then again a mirror is considered and this code is reflected here and this code will be reflected here so this code reflection will be like this 0110 its reflection will be 0 1 1 0 then for this its reflection will be 1 1 0 0 and for msb first half rows will be filled with 0 and next last half of the rows will be filled with 1 this is how we can write the gray codes for any number of bits so to write gray code of 2 bit we require gray code of 1 bit to write gray code for 3 bit we require gray code of 2 bit likewise you can write gray code for any number of bits but 
or by using this truth table that is binary to gray conversion so this is in short this is gray code for 0 this is gray code for 1 this is gray code for 2 this is gray code for 3 see this is not weighted binary code weighted code binary code is a weighted code where each bit will be assigned a weight and you can sum up those weights to convert it into decimal so though it is 0 1 1 it's it is 3 in binary but it is 2 in gray code 0 1 0 is 2 in binary but this is gray code so here it is 3 so this is 0 gray code of z, uh, 0 this is gray code for 1 gray code for 2 3 4 5 6 7 so remember that gray code is not weighted code now we'll see how we can convert binary number to gray number directly okay so consider this is 4 bit binary number b3 b2 b1 b0 we have to convert it into gray code g3 g2 g1 g0 to convert this we copy b3 as it is to g3 these are four bits this is lsb this is msb msb is copied as it is then b3 xor b2 gives us g2 b2 xor b1 gives us g1 and b1 xor b0 gives us g0 we'll see one example of binary to gray conversion so before we go towards binary gray conversion we'll first revise the truth table for xor 0 0 0 xor 0 is 0 0 xor 1 is 1 1 xor 0 is 1 and 1 xor 1 is 0 so xor is exclusive i or so either both should be true sorry either of the a or b should be true if both are true then result is false if both are false then also result is false so that's what we mean by exclusive it should be either A or B but not both. Either A or B or not both. Or in short, it is addition without carry. So 0 plus 0 is 0. 0 plus 1 is 1. 1 plus 0 is 1. 1 plus 1 is 0. Carry 1. So sum is 0. So this is about XOR truth table. Consider this is binary number 0, 0, 1, 1. We have to convert it into gray code so now we know the formula we copy this bit as it is so this 0 is copied as it is then we XOR this 0 and 0 so 0 XOR 0 is 0 then 0 XOR 1 is 1 and 1 XOR 1 is 0 so binary number 0 0 1 1 is equivalent to gray code 0 0 1 0 one more example binary number 1 0 1 0 we copy this one as it is 1 xor 0 is 1 0 xor 1 is 1 1 xor 0 is 1 so if binary number is 1 0 1 0 it's equivalent to gray code is 1 1 1 1 now next is gray to binary conversion so again consider it is 4 bit gray code g3 g2 g1 g0 we have to convert it into equivalent binary number so again b3 is as it is g3 b2 is b3 xor g2 b1 is b2 xor g1 and b0 
is b1 xor g0 in binary to gray it was this xor this equal to this this xor this equal to this this xor this equal to this here in gray to binary this binary higher bit binary xor g2 is b2 b2 xor g1 is b1 and b1 xor g0 is b0 again example for gray to binary this is 1 0 1 this one is copied as it is then 1 xor 0 is 1 1 xor 1 is 0 0 xor 0 is 0 so if gray number is 1 0 1 0 its equivalent binary is 1 1 0 0 one more example if gray number is 1 1 1 0 1, 1 copied as it is then 1 xor 1 is 0 0 xor 1 is 1 and 1 xor 0 is 1 so if gray number is 1 1 1 0 1, its equivalent binary is 1 0 1 1 i hope you have understood concept of gray code and its conversion into binary and converting binary into gray code if you like the video press like button given below the video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you very much